Welcome to Keydet Rewind for September 12th. The VMI football team notched its first win of 2016 on the road, defeating Moorhead State 17-13. It was VMI's first road non-conference win since 2007, and the fewest points allowed a VMI opponent since the 2013 season. The Kitas did not commit an offensive turnover for the second straight game and featured a balanced attack of 186 yards passing and 148 yards on the ground. Quarterback Al Cobb tossed touchdown passes of 43 yards to Dane Fourlines and 12 yards to Aaron Sanders to help give the Kedats a lead they would never relinquish. Defensively, junior safety Greg Sanders had 10 tackles, including one for loss and deflected a pass. With a bye week this Saturday, VMI resumes action September 24th at Bucknell with kickoff at 3 p.m. Women's soccer dropped a pair of tough matches this week, falling to Campbell and Mount St. Mary's over the weekend at Patch and Field. In Sunday's game, the Kedats got scoring from Amy Horney when she headed home an Emma Quirk corner kick to open up the game scoring. The team, now 3-4, and four, returns to action Friday in a road match against St. Francis of Pennsylvania at 4 p.m. The VMI men's soccer team continued to battle but fell 2-0 in a loss to Buffalo on a hot Friday afternoon in Lexington. The Bulls came in with a perfect 4-0 record and looked the part as they entered the match receiving top 25 votes in the most recent standings. Buffalo's Braden Scales scored both of his team's goals as he put the first one in midway through the first half and the other just 16 seconds into the second half. Buffalo outshot the Kedets by a 21-4 margin throughout the game. VMI's Jonathan Martinez led the Kedets with two shot attempts for the afternoon. The Kedets returned to action this Saturday on the road as they take on Gardner-Webb at 6 p.m. in Boiling Springs, North Carolina. Cross Country was in action at JMU Saturday, and Jay Broom captured the first individual title for Akita since Noah Hagos won at Furman in 2011. Brandon White ran second overall. On the women's side, Logan Luckett finished 11th and became only the third freshman woman in the last decade to be VMI's number one runner in back-to-back -back races. And don't forget the tickets for all four VMI home football games are now on sale. The Kedats open the home slate Saturday, October 1st in a Southern Conference matchup against Mercer. For tickets, log on to VMITickets.com or call 540-464-7266. And that will do it for this week's Kedat Rewind. For RuTube, I'm Wade Branner.